everybody. This is the Apple Helper here. I'd like to show you a cool project you can do at home. You can do this in about, I don't know, let's say maybe an hour. If you already have the supplies, you can do it in about 30 minutes. So, it's just a cool little weekend project thing. Um, Kip K has a video up on this, and I had made one of these a while back before, and I thought it'd be cool to show it like he did in his video. I saw his video, and I thought, oh, hey, I've made one of these before. And so, here it is. Here's my bucket that I've cut the hole out. You cut a hole and put something in it. I put a medicine bottle. He did, uh, I believe he did a hose or something. A pool hose, I think. So I just stuck, I just cut out a medicine bottle with a Dremel. And, yeah, it's just a bucket. And then on here, a fan. 9 volt battery and a battery clip. A little computer fan, 12 volts. So, Stick that on top. Inside, you put like boiling water for the best effect. Now remember, the hotter the water, the quicker it's going to quit, but the more fog you're going to get at the moment. So if you put cool, cooler water in there, like warm, just warm water, it's going to last a while, but not as much heavy fog. Put boiling water, it's going to be a lot of fog at once, but then it's going to kind of just simmer down real quick. But you put boiling water and some dry ice in there, and then. Stick the lid on and turn on the fan, and the fog comes out. So, that's pretty much it. Um, I'm sure some of you have seen my other crazy, completely crazy videos. Some of them are funny, some of them are awesome, and some of them make absolutely no sense. Comment, tell me what you think. Because literally, I spend five minutes each day checking comments, and so far, only one person has commented on any of my videos. Please comment! And subscribe if you like crazy stuff, technology stuff, funny stuff, pretty much anything that qualifies as stuff. Later I will do a um, video, I'm still working out the tweets, but later I'll do a video on my way of porting Siri to the iPhone 4 and iPhone 3GS. The iPhone 3G, it works with, just it's so slow, it's not really worth it. But, anyway... There you have it. Enjoy.